hello everyone in the today video tutorial we are going to discuss how to create a material master with external number range how to create material master from copying the another material how to maintain the missing views and how to extend the material master from one plant to another plant okay without any further ado let's get started enter the transaction code mm01 now press enter key here i am going to put some number in the material field okay i am going to create raw material for example i am putting raw 1 2 3 next enter the industrial sector next enter the your material type my material type is harvo h now press enter key Views already selected. Now press enter key. Enter your organization data. Now click on right mark or press enter key. Now enter the description. Description I am going to enter raw material. Enter the unit of measure PC. Enter your material group. Here I am entering the data based on my requirement okay now enter the sales tax classification I'm going to maintain here zero tax because this is not saleable material now press enter key enter this data flowing by default from material type press enter key enter here transportation group enter loading group now press enter key enter if required you can enter the sales text just click here press enter key enter purchase group purchase group i am going to enter 001 now press enter key press enter key enter purchase text click here now press enter key mrp controller i'm going to enter 001 lot size enter ex plant delivery time i'm going to enter 10 days schedule margin key triple zero enter 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 now enter the valuation class press enter key press enter key enter 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 just ignore the warning message in my case i am not going to enter the valuation category finally save the material master my material master is created with external number range now i am going to create material master by referring the other material enter the transaction code mm01 now press enter key here i am going to use previously created material raw 1 2 3 material okay now press enter key select the views press enter key enter your organization data here we need to enter the organization data of this material okay now click on write mark if you want to change the material description you can change now press enter key all the data system copies from reference material okay now press enter key see all the data system copying automatically from reference material here just we need to press the enter key so yeah this backspace click here enter enter all the data system copying from reference material here no need to enter the any data newly if required we can change the data that's it now click on yes it saves the material now i am going to show how to maintain the missing views go to the transaction code mm01 now press enter key press enter here i am deselecting the 
quality management view okay how i can maintain it again okay that i am going to show now press enter key or click on right mark enter the organization data now click on right mark so here just enter the material description material description i'm going to enter raw material enter unit of measure just create as usual system don't allow to skip the mandatory fields without maintaining the mandatory field we can't move to next screen enter purchase group Yes, my material is created. In this case, beginners do the mistake. They will go to maintain the missing views in MM02. That is absolutely wrong. We can maintain the missing views in MM01 only. Okay. Now, just put the material here. Okay. Now press Enter key. See here, I selected all the views. Here what system will do, system skips the already maintained views, it only automatically goes to the which view not maintained. In my case, I am not maintained quality management view. So hence system automatically goes to the that view. So now I am pressing enter key. See system skips the all the views, it automatically goes to the quality management view. Yeah, now press enter key. See, system automatically landed to quality management view. Okay, now press enter key, click on yes, yes. Now my material is saved. Okay, now I am going to the MM02 transaction. Okay, just press enter key. Here in the MM02 system shows only already maintained views, it won't show any views which is not maintained in mm01 okay it only shows already maintained views okay if you want to change anything in the material master you can change in mm02 for example if you want to change the description you can change the description of the material okay now i am going to change the description of the material here we can track the all the changes of the material master okay now i am going to put this text okay now i just put this text okay now save it to save click on this save button or press ctrl s also okay now press enter key we can check the changes click on environment here click on display changes see here we can see the changes so just double click on the line here we can see the changes earlier text is raw material now i changed the text now i will show how to create the same material to another plant just go to the transaction code mm01 here enter the material enter the material in reference field also now press enter key press enter key again here i am going to create this material in 1100 plant hence i am going to enter 1100 plant okay so here we need to enter the organization data of this material okay here we need to enter organization data of this material okay so same material now belongs to the two different plant so once i finish the creation just click on the right mark 
all the data system copies from reference material here we can observe system automatically skipped the basic data 1 and basic data 2 view why because basic data 1 and basic data 2 view comes in client level hence we can't maintain different data in different plant okay whatever the data we maintains in the basic data 1 and basic data 2 it belongs to the client level data okay for example material description and unit of measure this is client level data okay now press enter key click here so all the data system automatically copied from reference material with a reference plant so now i am going to change this mrp controller press enter key so here in the plan delivery time i am going to change 8 days so based on requirement we can change the data okay enter enter so now valuation category is not required in my case hence i am not going to enter the valuation category enter now click on save yes now my material is extended to another plant how we can check whether my material is extended or not to another plant we can check in mm60 report go to the slash n mm60 now press enter key enter the material just remove the plant now click on execute option or press f8 key from your keyboard yes same material we created in different plant okay that's a today video tutorial if you have any queries or any suggestions please comment me i will try to answer please please subscribe my youtube channel thank you